so excited so we flew overnight um, from London to Nairobi and now we're at the Safari Link uh, airport and we're gonna board one of these little babies um, and fly to the Maasai Mara so exciting I want to see a baby giraffe <laughs> Totally kitted out. So cute. Thank you. And then coming through here to the back of the bedroom, I've got the bathroom. Totally kitted out. We even got Miller Harris products. That's brilliant. I've got like a little desk and a wardrobe area. Toilets through there. And then I've got my jungle shower. in the woods. Uh, there's a roaring fire, lots of dinner and drinks going on over there and then I think we're going to be entertained by some Maasai Mara dancers which is very exciting and it's probably the guys who greeted us when we arrived as well so that's even better so bring it on. <laughs> So we have arrived at the 
rhino station because we're here to meet one of only two of the white rhinos left in the Masai Mara and we're just walking down the road and he's literally there so close okay. how super cute they are look they're just so close I love it <laughs> hi <laughs> Guys, I can't believe how close we are to this rhino. Look, he's literally right there in front of the car. Bonkers. set us loose on the shop. So let's see what everyone gets. <laughs> the other guys are still in there, bartering away. But I've come out because it's a bit dark in there, so I've come out to chill in the car and relax for a bit. <laughs> This is an actual Maasai village that we've come to visit. Where are the kids are out? That's so cute. Showing us how they make fire. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Whoa. Bye bye. 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 Uh, bye bye. This is so my kind of airport. So basically, here's the cars. They're unpacking. That's my case. Going there. Straight onto the flight. Best security I've ever seen. Bring it on. <laughs> More flights like this, please. Right, let's get on the flight. <laughs> We've just arrived in Nairobi after an amazing whirlwind couple of days in Masai Mara, which wasn't long enough because I would have absolutely loved to have stayed longer. Um, but we're here in the Nairobi Fairmont, Norfolk, for one night. Um, lots of piano, bar music going on behind me. It's quite colonial and beautiful this hotel uh, and we're going to be having some Spanish tapas uh, dinner out on the terrace um, and then tomorrow morning we're off again um, quite quite quickly off to the fair Mount, Mount Kenya uh, which is meant to be amazing set in the mountain tops and hillsides um, so but first dinner and then bed much needed bed because I'm absolutely exhausted <laughs> Meet you. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to Fairmont Mount Kenya Safari Club at the heart of Mount Kenya. Welcome. Thank you very much. This is my little bungalow. So I'm going to take you on a little show around. This is the lovely living room with a log fire which they light at night. Little telly, tea and coffee. And you come through here. It's really old school, colonial. It's gorgeous. So I four poster, four pillar bed. And then a little dressing area and another log fire through there. And then this is the bathroom, which is super pretty. Toilet through there, lovely big shower, lots of fluffy robes and towels and flowers. Really cute room, love it. And look how cute the entrance is to the hotel. Got a little elephant welcoming us to the Mount Kenya Safari Club. Very stylish. <laughs> And then a lovely round driveway and then we come through to the main area. Hello! <laughs> and then we come into this gorgeous atrium area. Oh, look at these flowers. So pretty. And then out through to the veranda. 
Oh, it's so gorgeous in Oscar. Just imagine having afternoon tea here. <laughs> Look at this guy. He wants to play chess by the looks of it. <gasps> so beautiful. We're actually on the line of the equator. So they brought us to the rose garden here, which is stunning. And then we're going to have um, an equator ceremony. I don't know what that means. <laughs> you will be on the red carpet. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Perfect. Enjoy. <laughs> so basically, when we're in the northern hemisphere, yeah. the petal makes the water turn clockwise. Which is like... So now we're in the southern hemisphere, and it should go anti-clockwise. So if you try to look very well here, ah. this one is standing still. No moving. Yeah. Look, it's only moving from the middle. guys I'm at the equator line so this side is a northern hemisphere this side is a southern hemisphere I've done the ceremony already but I'm gonna jump the equator okay. this hotel is so beautiful it's like a classic old country house overlooking the mountains in the back and then we've got this lovely swimming pool here I think we'll have to come back here tomorrow and do some shooting. It's really nice. Hi, dude. <gasps> Check you out. Gotcha. You're amazing. Look what's behind me. How beautiful is he? What a beautiful peacock. I love him. He's just hanging around in the grounds of the hotel. Incredible. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's so cute. Big. Where are we going? Oh, oh hi. <laughs> So this is actually within the grounds of our hotel. It's a Mount Kenya Wildlife Con Conservancy. Um, and it's a gorgeous uh, little an animal orphanage. So you love our chance to feed the bongo. And uh, we also have so many other species of animals. We have cheetahs here, there's Ooh. a leopard. Uh, we have pygmy hippos, uh, oh. the African lynx, and so many other animals. Inside here we have the African lynx. Oh, yeah. oh it's cut. Ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah. And where did you find them? What was wrong with them? They were rescued in Samburu. They were found abandoned as very little cubs. Oh. Yeah, so we've raised them here. We plan to release them back into the wild. Lovely. Yeah. Bongo antelope. There's only a hundred left in the world. Yeah, let me get some. Hello, everyone. What's your name? Can you with this? Oh, what a cutie. Lovely. The bongo is coming out. He wants yeah. to be fed. Oh, yeah. Hello. Oh, like that, oh, another one is coming. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are they sharing it? <laughs> no. You can do that. That's amazing. She's amazing. He was found abandoned in Samburu when he was about four months old. Beautiful. Yeah. Uh, cheetah is the most endangered cat in the world today. Morning guys, so we are off to Mount Kenya this morning for breakfast in the mountains. Uh, the Jeep has come to pick us up, so off we go. Oh, this is gorgeous, so we've got breakfast here. arrived because we're going to be riding back down the mountain after breakfast on these guys. They're so beautiful. I love this little white one. Uh, so this is my horse that we're going on. Say hi. Hi. Meg's getting on her horse now. 
So we're off on a pony trek now, and my horse is just obsessed with Dominica's horse's bottom. <laughs> <laughs> so I think we might be riding behind you. <laughs> and we're off. <laughs> the scenery here is so spectacular. Yeah, it's just such a gorgeous yeah. day. It seems I've made a friend. This is the garden of my little villa here at uh, Mount Kenya. And this is my little visitor, my little guest that comes to visit me every day, every morning. Oh my gosh, look, and does this. He's just absolutely stunning. He's been in the garden literally for about 20 minutes just hanging out. heading off to the airport because we're here at the Norfolk right now in Nairobi and it's our last night of safari. It's so sad, I can't believe it's all come to an end, um, but all good things come to an end, so back to London. Um, but it has actually been one of the most amazing trips I've been on. The Maasai Mara was like nothing else I've ever experienced. Coming so close to Oh my god, so many animals, giraffes and lions and super close to lions in fact. I think that was the that was my favourite part. And then I loved Mount Kenya with the peacocks and then we came back to uh, the Norfolk here in Nairobi to chill out a bit. The weather wasn't so good here but um, you can't have everything. Um, but yeah, it's been absolutely amazing. So big, big thank you to Fairmont Hotels for bringing me out here and also Citizen Femme um, for organising the whole trip. It has been awesome. Um, and I've met some amazing, amazing new friends as well. So yeah, safari over and out. Yeah.